Time for another game of Will It Be Infected? Hey, aficionados, Sean here. It's time to play a game. Here, we have a beer from Jackie O's. Apparently, Jackie O's recently has been having some major issues with bottling to the point where they've been forced to basically order a brand new bottler. They say that they're going to start pasteurizing all their beers. And there's a blog post on the website if you look for it. And if you've been to Jackie O's recently, make sure you check it out because there's a, a big list of their beers that apparently have been having infection issues. And luckily for me, I happened to trade for some Jackie O's recently and all three of the beers that I traded for were on that list, including this one. So I guess we're going to have a little mini-series here of Will It Be Infected games. The first one we have here is Black Mask. So this one is a bourbon barrel aged stout with coffee, cacao nibs, and vanilla beans. And it's 12% ABV. This is the 2017 version. And they say that it's been aged for a full year in bourbon barrels. So yeah, sounds really good. I've heard really good things about it. Let's dig into it and see if it's infected. And if it's not infected, Let's see how good it is. Okay, so we're starting off good on the aroma. It doesn't smell off to me. It smells fudgy. It smells bourbony. You're definitely getting the roasty coffee character. Lots of vanilla. This toffee, almost butterscotch kind of sweetness. But yeah, really kind of rich smelling. Definitely boozy and bourbony. Desserty. Let's get the taste. Cheers. It's not bad, but hold on. Oh, yeah. So yeah, it is slightly infected. I don't think, I mean, it is affecting the taste, but it doesn't have off flavors. And that's kind of the weird part. Like it just feels a little bit more carbonated than it should be. And it feels like it affects the flavors in terms of like pulling back the flavors a little bit. The richness, the sweetness, the bourbony notes, they feel lighter. They feel like they're not there as much in the taste. Again, you're getting that prickly kind of carbonation character in the mouth that you're really probably not supposed to be getting. It like foams up in your mouth. And I feel like it just like pushes those flavors along and just kills the flavor. Like, oh man, that's, it's like a tease. But the flavors that are left, again, they're not bad. It's not off. You get the roastiness. You get that fudgy, dark chocolate kind of character. And you get some of the bourbony notes too, like the oak, vanilla, the bourbon flavors. It kind of reminds me a little bit of the previous infected barrel aged stout that I had from Bottle Logic, the Fundamental Observation, which kind of tastes a little bit like Dr. Pepper. It's not quite like that, but like it has similar notes. And again, the carbonation character, but it's not quite as bad as the Bottle Logic was. It still has a little bit more of like the base flavors and it's not quite as like over carbonated all right so for the final thoughts and the rating there's going to be no rating i'm not going to bother there's no point um if i was rating the aroma it'd be an a plus it smells amazing but again the taste has been affected by the carbonation by the infection so i can't give it a rating but i can say to not write off jackie o's and to hang in there with them because they are making some really, really good barrel aged beers. Maybe just wait until they're starting to pasteurize and they have their new bottling system up and running. But they're also doing an exchange program too, which I don't think I've mentioned so far. And I need to find out whether it's empty bottles or not because if it's empty bottles, then I'm gonna send the empty bottles back. But yeah, if you have an infected beer from Jackie O's and you live near the brewery, or if you can send it back to whoever lives near the brewery, do that because they are exchanging for new bottles. 
So did any of you guys get any infected bottles from Jackie O's? Have you had any non-infected bottles from Jackie O's? What do you think of the brewery? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Until next time, drink responsibly and passionately. Thanks for watching.